The left atrium is very special because it's not myocardial tissue per se. It consists of specialized uh, tissue from the pulmonary veins and the walls of the left atrium are very thin. Physiologically, the left atrium has three functions. It has the reservoir function, the conduit function and the pump function. And reservoir function means the systolic filling of the left atrium. Conduit function is the phase when the mitral valve is open and the left atrium is filled by blood. And the LA pump function occurs when left atrial contraction takes place. And most of the filling of the left ventricle is during reservoir function and only a small portion is performed during LA contraction. And schematically you can see LA function in this curve. You can see in the systole the filling and then the opening of the mitral valve, the conduit function and then you can see atrial contraction. It's interesting. So here when we see during systole the strain is positive but in the left ventricle, the strain would be negative, I guess because as the atria fill, it's causing stretch or elongation, so therefore the strain would be positive, this peak systolic left atrial strain. I think this is an important point that LA strain has a positive value, whereas LV strain has a negative value. And looking at this curve, it resembles like a mirror image to the left ventricular strain.